What is going on? Gaming with Style here. Jay coming at you with a log bait video. I know Andin did a video on this. I just need to see if it works. I've used it to get far up in Hog Mountain. And now we're just going to see if it works in Legendary. As we're going to get right into a battle. And uh, once again, shout out to the Big Baller Clan. We have about 10 spots left. If you're a Big Baller fan, join the Big Baller Clan. You get what I'm saying? And so, with this deck, it's really cycles. You want to cycle that Ice Spirit. And I did try and hit both things with the rocket. It wasn't possible, though. So we put a knight to shield our tower from these fire spirits. And put down a princess to take out that furnace. Now, as he threw a goblin barrel for our princess, we didn't do anything about it. He threw a pump in the back, so we rocketed it. We used rocket to take out some damage on his tower and his pump. We thought about logging, we didn't. And then again, those fire spirits. So we threw an ice spirit and a goblin barrel. He fireballed the barrel, missed a goblin that got a couple hits off. And the spirit that surprisingly was still alive took out the next two fire spirits. And as he did put a new furnace in the back, I decided not to rocket that one. Let's put a princess behind the knight and let it go to work. So it took out those fire spirits. And he put down a mega knight. Obviously his card of the game, so we nadoed. Put a goblin gang, so he didn't get all of it. And then we ice spirit. And we used log to take out the fire spirits and the goblins. As that mega knight would go down, rest in peace. That really did nothing to our tower. That's the beauty of this deck though. There's nothing to take care of tanks and you can still take care of them. Because three elixir knight can defend anything in the game. As he puts down an inferno, we throw a deep goblin barrel. He ends up fireballing all of that. And then that inferno tower is there to stay. As we princess for the spirits. That will also go for the inferno tower. But he puts down a furnace, which gets in the way. And as that ice spirit goes on, that allows the princess to get a couple extra hits. And as the spirits come out, that'd be game. There, the princess got the one. That's about it. So he threw a barrel, and I threw down a rocket. Now I'm going to nade the bats for some dumb reason as he puts down another furnace. We go with another princess and a knight. 30 seconds left in the game. We go in with the god barrel trying to clutch this. As he goes in with his god barrel, we only ice spirit. Too bad we didn't have our zap. Could have taken out his goblin barrel. That knight does work on the furnace and those spirit gobs do work on the bats. Those spirits on the right hand got me nervous. Knight for the mega knight. NATO that goblin gang put down everything to protect our tower here's where we went all in though after we countered his goblin barrel we threw down one of our own with the princess i was gonna rock it if needed but it was not needed as we get the win when does he live? so as you can see this log bait does work like a charm and if you need to see it again, here it is. Princess Knight, Goblin Barrel, Rocket, Tornado, Log, Ice Spirit, and Goblin Gang. Shout out to the Big Baller Clan. Shout out to Andin. And yeah, so from me, Andin, and Noah, we'll see you all in the next video. Hit that like button, subscribe, and we will see you all in the next one.